Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into a major shift in the wireless power, one that's going to change things as dramatically as the invention. We're talking about wireless power dream. Yeah, you heard that right. 124 years ago Nikola Tesla dreamed of a world powered by wireless electricity, a vision so bold it seemed like science fiction, but today, that dream is finally becoming reality. In 1901 inventor Nikola Tesla imagined a future where electricity flowed through the air just like radio waves, powering homes, cities, even vehicles, all without a single wire. He built massive towers and tested his theories, but the technology of his time couldn't keep up. Investors pulled out, and his vision was left to history for a while. Fast forward to the 1960s, engineer William C. Brown achieved a major breakthrough, flying a helicopter using microwave power from the ground. Then in 1975, NASA joined the effort, transmitting 30 kilowatts over 1.6 kilometers. The efficiency? Only 50%, but it proved Tesla wasn't crazy, the science was real. Modern advances in computing, lasers and materials are now transforming wireless power from a curiosity into a revolution. Companies like Emrod in New Zealand and ReachPower in the US are achieving efficiencies of 95% and aiming for 99%. Imagine beaming electricity as easily as sending Wi-Fi. So how does it work? It's all about electromagnetic waves like microwaves, radio waves and even lasers. Energy is converted into a beam and sent to a receiving antenna called a rectenna, which converts it back into electricity. No wires, no copper loss, just clean targeted power. Now imagine collecting solar power in space, where the sun always shines, and beaming it back to Earth. That's the goal of JAXA, Japan's space agency, which plans to deliver 1 gigawatt of space-based solar energy, equal to a nuclear plant, by 2030. Is it safe? Surprisingly, yes. These systems use low energy densities, much like NASA's deep space communication systems. Built-in safeguards ensure the beams don't harm people, animals, or the environment. Think of it like a laser pointer, but for power. This isn't just about convenience, it's about accessibility. Remote areas could get electricity without building power lines, EVs could charge while driving and drones could fly forever without landing. Even in space, satellites and moon bases could run on beamed power. Tesla didn't just dream big, he dreamed beyond Earth. You might be surprised to learn this tech is already in use. Companies like Powercast and Y Charge are powering sensors, lights and more, all without wires. This is the beginning of the wireless electricity era. From lab experiments to powering your home the journey of wireless power is just getting started. The dream that began in 1901 is no longer fiction, it's happening, right now. And in the next few years, your home, your car, your entire world might be powered through the air. Nikola Tesla saw the future and now, so can we. Building traditional electrical infrastructure is expensive, time-consuming and often impractical, especially in rugged terrain or developing regions. Wireless electricity bypasses this entirely. No poles, no underground cables, just a transmitter, a receiver, and a clean beam of power. This technology empowers humanitarian efforts, disaster recovery and off-grid living. It could also be crucial in climate adaptation, powering mobile hospitals, temporary shelters and relief operations in areas hit by floods, fires or earthquakes. Clean energy isn't just about how we produce power, it's also about how we deliver it. Currently we lose up to 10% of electricity during long-distance transmission. Wireless systems drastically cut this loss, making renewables more efficient and viable, especially when generated far from cities. Combine solar, wind, geothermal and wireless power beaming, and suddenly a net-zero carbon future becomes a lot more realistic. Of course no revolution comes without roadblocks. Challenges include weather interference, alignment precision and regulatory hurdles, because yes, governments must approve beaming energy through the air. Then there's public perception. People hear microwave beams and imagine death rays, not realizing it's often less powerful than a phone signal. But each challenge is being tackled, with AI-assisted targeting beam shaping and safety cutoffs. Engineers and policymakers are working hand-in-hand -hand to ensure a safe rollout. With every new test, every new prototype and every successful transmission, Tesla's dream comes closer to your doorstep. This isn't just the future, it's the future happening now. Imagine never stopping to charge your car. Highways that power your vehicle as you drive, wirelessly. Sounds futuristic? It's already being tested. Wireless dynamic charging could eliminate range anxiety, reduce battery size, and revolutionize how we think about electric mobility. Buses, trucks, taxis, even autonomous vehicles 
could run 24 7 powered by the very roads they ride on, the grid becomes the ground beneath your tires. In factories, warehouses, and skies above cities, wireless power could make machines truly autonomous. Drones delivering packages could fly continuously, no downtime for recharging. Warehouse robots could operate non-stop, improving productivity. Even remote sensors in agriculture or smart cities could stay powered for years without maintenance. It's not just about convenience, it's about unlocking new economic models, where machines are no longer bound by battery life. What happens when electricity becomes as accessible as Wi-Fi? A new energy economy emerges, where power isn't something you plug into, but something all around you. You could subscribe to energy services the way you subscribe to Netflix. Rent power while traveling, beam energy from your solar panels to someone across town, or sell unused power from your EV back into the wireless grid. Energy will no longer be locked in wires or monopolized by utilities. It will be flexible, decentralized and democratized. From a forgotten tower on Long Island to satellites beaming power from space, we've come a long way. Tesla's dream is no longer just a spark, it's a global ignition. So what do you think? Are we ready for a world without wires? If this blew your mind or even sparked your curiosity, hit that like button, subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss what's coming next. The future of power is wireless. The future is already charging.